Okay, so on this one, I've got skates underneath all four. We also did try to locate the neutral override um, device in this, not in the trunk. So, now we didn't drop this here, but um, I've already prepped the vehicle with skates and everything that's going to need for transport or for loading. And then we'll also, so this vehicle, um, we're not sure if this is transmission fluid or if this is oil. So we're, it's going to be a, a no attempt to start for, okay. Whoa. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, that would have stumped so bad. Um. Yeah, so I uh, I apologize. So um, do you Drop know how to take off. it off? Yeah, do you know how to take it off? So as long as it stays in park, it won't roll away from us. Um, it's not that we could get it into neutral anyways, because as soon as you go to start it, it'll go back into park. It might. Is it not wanting to go off? So a lot of times, every time you open the door, it'll go right back on. There we go. Thank you. Sorry about stepping on your toe, man. what we want staying on the skates okay so this is this is not a front wheel drive it's just a real wheel drive so since it's real wheel it's rolling on the skate okay yeah it's just rolling so I'm gonna grab it as soon as it starts to come out Cause these are rolling. All right, so now I'm gonna pop these straps so it goes straight up the bed. These are my least favorite ones, y'all. There was nothing in the vehicle for to be able to get it into neutral. So when I get to Creighton's, he'll have the tool for sure.
Did um, is Beamer's the people that's taking care of the bill or? Perfect. Do you want it to? Okay. Is powering on. It takes about two minutes to go through the little apps and then we'll be able to. Primarily the one in Kennesaw, but so we also tow for like other a lot of other BMW uh, shops, you know what I mean? But the one that's in Kennesaw is the primarily the one I've dealt with. I'm not even sure where the other one is. Where's that at? Yeah. Yeah, I uh, to be perfectly honest, man, when it, that's the only one that I knew of was that one. This is in tow right beside it, you know, that we, uh, I know those people, but I'd have to look it up to even know where that one was, just to be honest. They might have, because it's maybe not our closest one, they might have like another tow truck company that's closest to there. here at this place at Beamers. Um, they have already checked the vehicle out and know exactly what we are working with here. So basically we're going to get those front tires right to the edge. Right. Just like that. so I can kind of keep my eyes on everything. It's a lot of times I do this for y'all, but let's just take a look.
soap on this. Coach it off. Hey Creighton, if you want, do you uh, you just want me out from underneath it because your go jacks will just lift, or do you want me to keep it up in the air for you? Um, can you, can you yes, sir. I can push it as far as you need me to. All right, just so that it's on the flat. Gotcha. Yep, I got you right now. As always, I appreciate the info, and I've learned so much just from dropping here. <laughs> oh yeah, it, it, you know that's the best way. With when you're working with this, as long as it's moving real slow, I'm happy. When it when you take the stuff off and it takes off on you, that's whenever you need to be worried. But um, he's he so he's covered with us, man. Um, I'm gonna give you one last little push all the way in, just so we can know that you're all the way flat surface. All right, brother. How do you feel about that? I appreciate you, man. Yes, sir. Bringing it now. Man, if you, I'm glad you said something because I have a bad tendency to take off with that. Thank you, brother. Yes, sir. All right, y'all. Um, let me uh, get back with y'all on the next one. Thank y'all for watching.